Who will do, tiddly peeps? I'm Hubba Hubba, talking to you from Hoobland, and I'm about to send four of my favourite hoobs down to Earth to find out all about you for my great Hoobopedia. Here they come! You know who the hoobs are? Ivor! Groove! And Tula! We're hoobs! And they're ready to go. Now the wheels are turning, we can all get learning all the things we want to know. Hey! Hubba Hubba's in Hoobland, and Roma's somewhere far away. The motorettes are singing, we keep the engine spinning. Hoop Hoop Hooray! The Hoobabill is coming your way. Oh, here we come! Uh, well, hey! The hoops are here, so yes. what do you say? Hoops! You know who the hoops are? I have a groove and a... Too long. Right. And... Yeah! Uh, 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 oh! Uh, 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 ow! Oh! 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 What are you doing? I'm doing hooby paw stands. I'm busy training to be a great gymnast. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> and what are you busy doing, Groove? Me? I'm busy relaxing. Here, <laughs> um, uh, ba! Oh. Ah, 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 oh. <laughs> Go, Tula! Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh dear. <laughs> Let me rub it better. I'd oh, give up if I were you, Tula. Give up? Never. Oh, no, Groove. The question is, how can Tula do hooby paw stands without getting hurt? Up, 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 that up. is the question. <laughs> Come on. Oh, just as I was getting comfy. How can Tula do hooby paw stands without getting hurt? That's a hooble dooble dooper question for Hoob News. <laughs> hooby paw standing hoobs everywhere will want to know the answer to that one. Actually, I, I think I already know the answer, Hubba Hubba. You, you do? do? Oh, yeah. What Tula needs is one of those big squashy mats that Tiddly Peeps have. Oh, Groove! You're a genius! <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll just go back upstairs and carry on relaxing, if that's OK by you. Um, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. Groove, come back. What now? There isn't room between all the hooby plants for a big squashy mat. No. Ivor, you're right. <laughs> but what's interesting about big squashy mats is that they're soft. And soft things are herbaceous to fall on. Now, let me see if I can find you some soft things that will fit between the hooby plants. Mm. Ah, a tiddly peep has sent in a story that might help. Mm. Have a look at this while I email Roma. <laughs> Gordon the giant was very, very lonely. And what he wanted most was someone to play with. I know, said Gordon one day. I'll go to the town and see if some of the children would like to play with me. So Gordon set off for the town. His feet went thud, thud, thud. And the ground shook beneath them. The children looked up when they heard the thudding. Quick! It's a giant! Run away! Oh, good! Said Gordon to himself. They want to play catch me if you can. So he thudded after them. Thud! 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 The children were very frightened. Let's run to the top of the tallest tower in the town! He won't be able to reach us up there! So the children ran right to the top of the tallest tower in the town. But the heavy thud, thud, thud of Gordon's feet was shaking the ground so much that the tallest tower in the town was starting to wobble. Oh, now the children are in there! The tower is going to fall down! We'll have to jump for it! cried a little boy. But we can't! said another. We'll hurt ourselves! Oh, no, you won't! called a loud voice below them. Jump onto my big soft 
Tommy, you'll be quite safe. So one by one, the children jumped out of the tower and landed on Gordon's big, soft tummy. This is fun! Oobie The answer was staring us in the face. Now then, who should it be? <laughs> <laughs> Not me, Tula. My tummy's nowhere near soft enough. Ah, but Grooves is. <laughs> hey? It is the softest, ah, squidgiest yeah. tummy yeah. I have ever seen. Ah, no, stop it, Tula. Stop it. <laughs> no, 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 don't poke me. Perfect stop me. it. And I won't hurt myself at all. Squidgy, 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 squidgy. Stop, squidge, 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 squidge. stop. <laughs> If you fall on my tummy, you won't get hurt, but I will. That's a fair point, Tula. Yeah, I've got a better idea. Let's use my collection of squidgy furry things. Ah, yeah, go on, it's bound to work. How? Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. ho. Here's how. Ta-da! My hooby groovy collection of squidgy fairy things, including my favourite kitten, Kevin. <laughs> hmm. It's not what great gymnasts usually use. No, 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 but it's what great hoob gymnasts use, or at least they will after you've shown them on hoob news. Go on, Tula, give it a try. Oh, all right. <laughs> Ready? And... Hip! Ah, ah, oh! <laughs> Oh, no, Kevin. Tula, I think you've broken his tail. Groove, how can Tula possibly use your squidgy furry things if you're going to make a fuss every time she falls on them? Well, it's not the answer anyway. I'm not sure which bit of Kevin I fell on, but it hurts. He might be soft, but he's too lumpy and bumpy. Hubba. 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 It's hubba hubba. Come on. Lumpy and bumpy? Oh, poor Kevin. How dare you call my Kevin lumpy and bumpy. <laughs> ah, Hoobs, there you are. Now, I've been searching Hoobnet and I think i found something rather soft and interesting. <laughs> oh, good. Take a look at this. It might help. Ah, now these are very interesting, Hoobs. These are bird's feathers, you see? And they're very soft. And they're very interesting because they come in all sorts of shapes and sizes and colours. Just like the birds on this peep planet. <laughs> yeah, you are, you see, there are some falling through the air. Aren't they absolutely hoople dooble duper? I knew I had some feathers somewhere. They were in my collection of things that fly away when it's windy. <laughs> Well done, Groove. Yeah. Oh, bacious. Now, all we've got to do is lay them out on the roof garden. But how? How, 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 how. How, 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 how. How, how, how. How, how, how. How, how, how. How, Here's how. Thanks, Ivor. Thanks, Groove. Yeah. They look so soft. Yeah. I can't wait to fall on them. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah, yeah, mm. Groove. Careful, careful. careful. Yeah, yeah. And... Hooray! <laughs> Here she comes. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Ah. <laughs> there you are. Didn't hurt a bit. Uh, Groove, what collection did you say these feathers came from? Things that fly away when it's windy collection. Come on, Tula. Uh, uh, let me rub it better. What's yeah. happened to my feathers? Oh, the wind has blown them all away. Oh, who be bother? Well, that's no good. Cheer up, Tula. We'll find something for you. Hubba, hubba, hubba. Hey, hubba. sounds like Hubba Hubba's already found something. <laughs> I've been thinking, Hoobs. Tiddly peeps are always falling over. <laughs> Why don't you go and ask them about soft things to land on? Oh, bacious idea. You go, Tula. I'll drive. Let's get those motorettes singing! Seat belt. Seat belt. We're off to see the tiddly peeps. Yeah?
We're off to see the tiddly peeps On the road we go We're off to see the tiddly peeps They're smart, they're fun, they know The tiddly peeps, the tiddly peeps Help us find things out They give us clues, they tell us news That's what they're all about We're off to see the tiddly peeps On the road we go We're off to see the tiddly peeps They're smart, they're fun Do you want to do a hooby hello? Yes. Who will do? Who will do? Who will do? Who Well, it looks like you're training to be great gymnasts. Not exactly, Tula. We're just playing, really. Well, I'm learning to be a great gymnast, but I keep falling over and hurting myself. Oh. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you should put a mat down. Well, I thought of that, but there wasn't enough room on the roof garden. I tried falling on feathers too, but the wind just... Blew them away. What about putting the feathers in something, Tula? In something? Yes, to make a cushion. Look. Watch. Oh, oh now look. <laughs> Cushions are just as soft as feathers because that's what they're filled with. But they won't blow away. <gasps> what a hoobly groobly idea. And you didn't hurt yourself, did you? Nope. Ivor, yeah. Groove, yeah. order some cushions from Hoobnet right away. Oh, I'll yes. be back to try them out in a moment. All right. Oh, Tiddly Peeps, thank you. You are so clever. That's OK, Tila. I'd better be off back to the Hooperbill now to practice my gymnastics. Hoople toodle do. Hoople toodle do. <laughs> Ah, who be groovy? <laughs> Do you know, these cushions are so soft I could just fall asleep right here. <laughs> Get off, Groove! Shoo! Oh, honestly, I was only testing them just to make sure they were soft enough for a great gymnast to use. <clears throat> and hip high. Oh, look, hope your hands are, hope your hands, hope your hands. Oh, I'm going. Oh, oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> hoop, hoop, hooray! Who be glad? Cushions are even better than feathers. I can practice at last. I'm going to practice all day. <laughs> I'm afraid you're wrong there, Tula. Look at those big black clouds. Who be bother? It's going to rain. This is hopeless. Oh, never mind, Tula. We'll just have to wait inside until it stops. Come on. I've seen them all on Hoobnet, those great gymnastic peeps, performing quite a lot. Jumps and bounds and leaps And now I've got hoobacious cushions to save me when I fall I'll practice until I'm the greatest gymnast of them all I'll practice on the roof garden beneath the hooby trees And with my squishy feathery friends I'll never bang my knees I'll dream of twirling in the air and I just know I could So I'll practice and practice and practice and practice until I'm really good I can see it now, Tula the crowd would simply stare as you, you brave and daring hoob, somersault in midair. Everyone is standing up. They woo and wow and yip as two of the greatest gymnast does a great hoobie backflip. All because of my lovely cushion, so squishy and squishy and soft. And after the rain, I'll practice again until Tula is tops. We've seen them all on Hoobnet, those great gymnastic peeps, performing quite alarming jumps and bounds and leaps. And now I've got two patience cushions to save me when I fall. I can practice until I'm the greatest gymnast of them all. The greatest gymnast of them all. Hoop hooray! It's stopped raining. <laughs> Ivor, <a> groove! <gasps> uh, oh no! They're ruined! They're all wet and yucky! Just look, look! Cushions are hopeless to use outside. Oh, Hobie, bother! Oh dear. And just when I thought we'd found the answer. Mm, uh, uh, I can't lie down either, otherwise I'll end up wet. <laughs> Roma. Who will do poobs? Who will do Roma? Now, Hubba Hubba tells me you're finding out about soft things, and that's why I've come here. Huh? That poor tiddly peep behind you. Yeah. What do you mean, Tula? 
She's all right. But she keeps falling over. Ow! There. See, she did it again. Oh! But every time she falls down, she bounces back up again. Can't you see? Roma's right, Tula. She doesn't look hurt at all. Mm. Are you sure? Must hurt when she hits the ground. No, Tula. This tiddly peep isn't falling onto the ground. She's using something called a trampoline. <laughs> it looks hoobie groovy. And it is hoobie groovy groove. A trampoline is like a special springy floor. It's ever so soft. So when you jump up and fall down onto it, it bounces you back up again. You don't hurt yourself at all. Hoopy galoopy. That sounds exactly what I want. Could we put one in the Hoopy Roof Garden, Roma? I mean, it wouldn't blow away or anything. No, trampolines are heavy, Tula. They couldn't possibly blow away. And do they mind the rain? Oh, no, they'd be fine out in the rain. They sound hoobly groobly. <laughs> so hoobly groobly, in fact, that I've sent you one to try out. A tiddly peep sized one. Perfect for hoobs. Oh, Roma! Thank you so much! Don't mention it, Tula. My pleasure. What's that? Who big a loopy? Apparently it's time for me to have a go. Oh. Coming! Sorry, Hoobs, gotta go. This is Roma Hoob off to get bouncy. Hoobble doodle do. Hoobble doodle do. <gasps> Hoobie Galoopy, it's here already. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I want to get bouncy too. I love bouncing. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> oh, this is going to work. Uh, I'm sure it is. Hold on, am I here? Oh, yes. Come on, Tula. Off you go. Ooh. How many you get? <laughs> oh, this. This is hoobly groobly. Oh. oh, oh, no, I forgot. I'm supposed to be doing hoobie paw stands. <clears throat> Hoopy bother. I could never do a hoopy paw stand on this. It's it's too small and mm, too bouncy. No. No, it's not. <laughs> it's hoopy <too> groovy. <laughs> oh, Ivor. What am I going to do? Um, boy, boy, uh, boy, boy, why don't we ask the tiddly peeps again? They must know of something else we could use. Yes, Ivor. Come on. <laughs> Boing, boing. We're off to see the tiddly peeps on the road we go. We're off to see the tiddly peeps. They're small, they're fun, they know. The tiddly peeps, the tiddly peeps, help us find things out. They give us clues, they tell us news. That's what they're all about. We're off to see the tiddly peeps On the road we go We're off to see the tiddly peeps They're smart, they're fun They know How do you do it? Like this? Who will do it, tiddly peeps? Who will do it, Tula? Now I need your help I need something to stop myself getting hurt when I practice my gymnastics. What have you tried so far? Well, I've tried using a trampoline, but it was no good for hoopy paw stands. What's a hoopy paw stand, Tula? Oh, dear. You know, <laughs> when you get your front paws on the ground and you kick up your back paws and you balance upside down. <laughs> oh, do you mean handstand like this? Yes, that's it. <gasps> Hoopy Galoopy, are you okay? Of course, she fell on the grass. Oh. And grass is soft. Yes. Why don't you use grass, Tula? Grass. Hmm. It does seem hoobly groobly, but I'm practising my gymnastics on the Hoobie roof garden. Could I put grass up there? Yes. Oh. And it won't blow away? Of course not. And... Does it matter if it gets rained on? No. Grass loves rain. It dries out really quickly. Hoopy Galoopy. It sounds like grass really could be the answer. Ivor! Groove! Yes. Yeah. Could you order me some grass from Hoobnet right away? <laughs> Thank you so much, Tiddly Peeps. I'd better hurry back now. I can't wait to try out my grass. Hoobble toodle do! Hoobble toodle do! Ha <laughs> ha!
nice and firm. Oh, yes, look. Mm, let me try. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Hoobly, groobly, can I try it? <sighs> it's all yours, Tula. Oh, and hip Oh! Oh, dear. Come on, Tula. I'll give you a rub. No, either. I don't need a rub. I'm not hurt. <laughs> not hurt? <gasps> That's it! We've done it! We've found something soft! And just in time for Hoob News! <laughs> soft is a pillow under your head Soft is the mattress on your bed Soft is the grass under Soft is a hoop when he's cuddling me. That was very nice, but let's sing the right words. Uh, what are the right words? I'll show you. Oh, I thought you'd say that. Golden slumbers kiss your eyes. Smiles await you when you rise. Sleep pretty too, till do not cry and I will sing a lullaby. I like my words best. Oh, sure. Well, Hoobs, are you ready with your news for my great Hoobapedia? Ready, ready hubba, hubba, hubba. hubba Then take it away. Hoobo do to all you hoobs out there, welcome to Hoob News, the new show for hoobs everywhere. I'm Ivor. I'm Tula. And I'm Groove. And today we've been asking the question... How can Tula do hooby paw stands without getting hurt? We wanted to find something soft to put on the ground. Tula wanted to use Groove's soft tummy. But funnily enough, I said no. Groove's collection of squidgy furry things was soft but too lumpy and bumpy. So we tried feathers, but they were really soft and the wind blew them away. Then the Tiddy Peeps suggested cushions, but they went all soggy when it rained. Then Roma sent us a herbaceous trampoline. Which was hooby groovy. But far too bouncy for hooby paw stands. Then the Tiddly Peeps told Tula about something that's really soft to fall on, doesn't blow away and dries out after the rain. It's grass! Hoobal doobal dooper! Now you've got your grass, I can see you turning out to be the greatest gymnast of them all, Tula. Well, I'm certainly going to try, Hubba Hubba. That's the spirit! So it's thanks once again to Ivor, Tula, Groove and Roma for giving hoobs everywhere a little peep into the world of peeps. And remember, wherever you are, may your landings always be soft ones. And hoobble toodle do! Hoobble toodle do! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> I never knew you could do hoobie paw stars. Yeah. Hoobie galooby! <laughs> <laughs> And Rome is somewhere far away The motorettes are singing We keep the engine spinning Hoop, hoop, hooray! The hoop is coming your way Oh, here we come! 